Well, hey, folks, this is Bill with Bill Reddick Outdoors. Just got in from work. Better give old Sambo and Derby a little something to eat. And I have to apologize to them every time I feed them. Because it has been so hot. I just don't feel like taking them out and dumping them all in them woods. You know, got just a little bit of chance of rain in the morning. I think like 30%, 40% maybe. But from what I hear, people have been seeing deer real regular lately. And I'm gonna get up early in the morning and I'm gonna be in my deer stand before the sun comes up. We ain't gonna miss our chance tomorrow. I'm gonna get up early. I think I'll set the clock for about four. I'm gonna be there before daylight and I'm gonna be waiting on that big book when he comes walking by. Now I don't claim to know everything there is about deer hunting. Hush, Derby. But one thing I do know is if you really want to increase your chances of success, getting there early is really important. Give the woods time to settle down. Oh no. I've done gone and slipped late. Well, I had a couple little setbacks this morning. And I've been hurrying to get to my deer woods because I got a couple hours of daylight left. And I told y'all I didn't know everything that there is to know about deer hunting. But there is one more thing that I do know, and that's that deer love acorns, especially white oak acorns. So I found me this beautiful pine flat. We're gonna set up in it and see what happens. Well, I had been sitting in the stand for about an hour, and all of a sudden, I heard this terrible noise coming through the woods. Hey, hey, what you doing? Girls, what are y'all up to? Riding the four-wheel. Well, you messing up my deer hunting. I'm trying to hunt deer. Could y'all ride way over on the other side of the woods the rest of the evening? Okay. okay. Alrighty. See y'all. And that is why it's very important to get up before daylight and get in the woods early. You'll be there before the four-wheeler riders is out of bed. Well, I still got just a few minutes before it gets dark. Decided to sit it out. I couldn't believe this happened in just a few minutes. It's been a good day. Well, I didn't get a deer that day, but I was out playing in God's creation that he has blessed us with. And that always makes it a good day. But I'd like to show y'all a picture of a deer that my son-in-law Josh got a few years back. He had took my advice about how deer really like acorns. And he was hunting in that same pine flat. And he caught this thing slipping through. Just remember folks, whether you're at work or play, 
I hope you have a nice day. This is Bill Reddick, Outdoors. See y'all.